Uh, hi everyone, and today I'm going to be showing you how to um, make a very effective, nice and easy border. I've used this border for many of my, uh, well, one of my Montas relatives, so I'm this um, border bet before I have used it. Um, so basically, I, I'm just going to apologise before I start, I had a brace put on today and now I kind of got really used to it yet, but I'll try my best. Um, basically, if you got a photo like this, it's a big A round, I'm just using the fake and use it for videos obviously, and just maintain, just maintaining the aspect ratio to no, so it fits the whole screen as you can see. Um, and then the I, I'm using Sony Vegas 8 at the moment. I haven't got 9 yet on this computer, but it works also for 9 as I've used it for 9 on my other computer. So basically, all we're going to do here is um no, we're not going to do that yet. Um, <clears throat> all we're going to do here is get a solid color, black, probably cause I think it does look the best and this is the nicest to work on um okay so just close that and uh about 50 i'd say um and then just go event pan crop okay and then if you see it down here it says mask click on that and then click this little button here anchor creation tool once you've clicked that just go across 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 you may have seen this obviously I'm not perfecting that out because there is no need uh, once you do that you can get the normal edit tool and move it about and um, select just um, if I can just one and sort of move it bow, give it some pretty effects like you can see on the screen and uh, make it look a bit cooler and whatnot. So yeah, um but yeah just so just basically move right on. Right, so yeah, just have that like that. So you've masked out this little section here, as you can see on the video, on the uh, picture there. Obviously, it's not any good yet, because um, I haven't moved or perfected it. But yours, obviously, you guys will be much, much better than mine. Right, if you um just zoom out with the scroll button, if you select path anti alias no and you've got the normal selection tool, you can actually just uh move this bit, I've got to mention it. So it doesn't curve, it just is nice and straight and then it looks a little bit nice and more neat and professional. Right, so there we go there is the start of your border and then you can just move the uh, opacity up and down to 100% I usually put it about 75 after I've done that um, it obviously you can, uh, I'll just show you guys Just you, you can just do it on both sides so you can just move that across um, wrong one sorry can just move that to there, that but obviously that will be the same as the one above but I'm just showing you guys and to delete that just you select um, the one underneath anchor deletion tool and then you just select all click it and that will go okay um, so once we've done that 
what we what we're gonna want to do is I'll just quickly move this down so it's a better um. Right. Okay. Um. Yes. Yeah, so once you've done that, what you're going to want to do is go uh, video FX and go border soft edge. You're going to want to put the border, uh, the soft edge border, on the um on the solid color. Okay. And you see, as soon as I put it on, you get a nice soft blurred effect around it. I mean, you can put it to any size. So you you can make like you can make it look just like that. And that does look effective. I've not seen anybody use that sort of border yet. But this is just a simple border. So basically you've got that. You've got a nice soft edge around the border. And that'll be on both sides. Um, and then once you've done that. There is. Uh, you want, you're going to want to also put some text in. So you get media generated text. Uh, default text. But do not, don't use the solid background because it won't show nicely. So you're gonna, you need to have it so with checkered background, so it's got no background. Okay, and then um, put. Oh, I'll just put pure kid. Um, there we go. Big. So we got that, and then uh, change the size, but too small. Right, there we go placement you're going to want to just go on placement up here move it up into the top right hand corner of your border you can if you want if that doesn't fit nicely over here go if um, effects and then go enable deformation and go compress vertically okay and as you can see already you know if you don't want to compress it that then fits much nicer in here um and there's other eff effects you can do on top of that, such as if you get a uh, video FX, you can let's see, you can um, if you see where the uh, TV simulator is, I'll use this one. Before. Uh, TV or well, bad sync looks a little bit nicer. So put bad sync on, okay? And you want line sync. You want that to be fine. You want vertical sync to be fine and uh, scan phase and you don't want issue you, you want that right. um okay, so that you want line sync and vertical sync to be all the way up to the right to the top so it doesn't move and then just do scan phase and to however much scanning you want just play around with it really you know make create your own stuff stack um, I wouldn't use too much static because as you can see, then it just disappears. But I mean, a little bit of static's nice. Um, so yeah, and then once once you get that, as you can see, it flashes, and that's very very original. I've not really seen anyone use that sort of stuff yet. Um, you can put other effects on. I mean, you can. You can do some waves on your um, on your border like that, and looks, you know, a bit unusual. But you know, there's, there's all sort there's all sorts of stuff you can you can do, and uh, yeah, it, it's a really generally effective. Um, so that it's quite an, it's a, an effective. Uh, An effective border, really. Yeah, uh, let's try that. See, so just slowly waving through, and then again. See, so just fast forward a bit, and it's a nice little border. Um, so yeah, that's about it. That's 
that's uh, my first tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe to the video. And um, good luck with your borders.